briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1994, the United States Court of Appeals for the Ninth Circuit heard a case involving a debtor, Gary Ronald Perez, who filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy after losing a legal battle with Frank Everett, leading to an important ruling on the absolute priority rule. Perez, who renovates and sells income property and owns two Jim Boys Tacos franchises, had hired Everett to oversee the remodeling of one franchise but ended up in a dispute leading to legal action. Despite losing the lawsuit, Perez sought to avoid paying Everett by filing for bankruptcy and proposing several reorganization plans. The third plan divided creditors into classes based on the nature of their claims, with Everett being placed in Class 4 as an unsecured creditor. While all other creditors approved the plan, Everett objected on the grounds of unfair treatment. The court agreed, finding that Perez's cram-down plan violated the absolute priority rule and failed to meet fiduciary obligations to creditors. In its decision, the court found that the bankruptcy court and BAP had approved a plan in violation of Section 1129, B's absolute priority rule. The court affirmed the holding on Everett's Section 1322 claim, but reversed the BAP's holding on cram-down, valuation, insolvency, and disclosure. The case was remanded to ensure that Everett was properly compensated according to the present value analysis and for further determination on remaining issues. Additionally, the court reminded counsel involved in the case of their responsibility to lead the estate on a just, speedy, inexpensive, and lawful path out of bankruptcy. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.